Hey guys, so we're here at uh, the Auto Show in Harrisburg, and I'm here to show you Sia Live, uh, how it works with Bluetooth. And we are on a Lexus LS460, very nice car. So I just want to show you how you can start up the car and start streaming automatically. And when you stop the car, it stops the streaming. So let's give this a go. Let's turn off the car here. All right, so the car's off. And now we're going to turn it on. and let the app do its magic with Bluetooth. So initially you can hear it on the phone because it takes a little time to get the pairing going on. But you can hear it right away on the phone. And now we can see that it just connected on the Bluetooth. So now we're streaming CLI on the phone. And it's pretty sweet. I mean, you don't have to get your hands out and be pressing buttons, you could have it in your pocket. And each time you get into the car, pairs up, starts streaming the last station you had on. So now let's, let's try turning off the car. And right away stops the music, as you can see. So again, let's, let's try this up again. I'm gonna turn on the car. And let's see it stream by itself. There it is. Now this is a very, very uh, good setup to have when you're commuting to work every day and it just saves the hassle of uh, of having to, you know, start up the streaming and, and having to do this. Now let me see if it actually works. So in this one, we have the Bluetooth connected that when you do the next track, it goes to your next favorite. So on the car, I'm pressing volume. I'm going to turn down the volume a little bit. So when you hit next track, it's going gonna, it's gonna to go to the next favorite. Let's see. So it goes to my next favorite on my list. Oh, so that radio is not working. There we go. Okay. So let's try another from my favorites, one of my favorite stations from Argentina, Sonic.fm. So as you can see, this is uh, CIA Live running on the Lexus LS460 and hope you enjoy it and you can try it out. Now show us, show us the, the advanced user settings, Okay. How, oh. how, how it works for connecting or disconnecting so when you turn your car off. Do we have any way to control that? Do we have more options? Uh, yes. So, okay, so let's say we go, we're gonna go to settings, and when you go to advanced users, there's the Bluetooth options. Now, you have to have your Bluetooth on, and you have to have your Bluetooth device already paired up to show on this list. So, in our case, this car is this one. And you can see the top one is on Bluetooth connect automatically to start playing. And you can check that or uncheck it. Oh, I think we switched it. There you go. So you can say that, no, I don't want you to start up automatically. Or, you know, these are the two options you have. Right now I have it that it starts up automatically and stops automatically when Bluetooth connects and disconnects. Hey guys, this is Jonah from uh, Visual Blaster showing you see Alive now on a BMW. Uh, we're doing right now streaming through Bluetooth and I got here the Bluetooth setting and I have it that it starts up automatically and stops automatically. Uh, let's check it out. So right now we're listening to this radio station but let's skip to our next favorite and it should go to our next favorite which is Adobe Radio. Put it right there. Let's see. Just let it play and then go to it. There we go. So let's go to the next favorite. So make that FM. And it's actually pretty sweet. Here, let me show you how it would look like if you have the car holder for your car. 